Millions of years ago, Australia was connected to Antarctica. This had a dramatic effect on the climate of both continents, as a connection between the two broke up the currents and weather systems that were circulating in the general area. Before they were separated, Australia was wetter and heavily wooded. Once it became detached, the currents and weather systems could circulate uninterrupted around the edge of the Antarctic continent. This in turn caused Antarctica to become colder and Australia to become drier and warmer, leading to the loss of most of the trees on the continent. Now we have an interesting parallel emerging in the Arctic. As the ice melts in the northwest and northeast passages, there is the possibility of a permanent ocean passage all the way around the Arctic. Could this also lead to a circulating of the weather systems and currents around the edge of the Arctic? This in turn poses a new question. Could the opening up of the passages also produce the same dramatic climate change that we had in the south, now in the north? If the changes were to follow the same pattern as occurred in the south, the Arctic would become colder than it is now, and Canada, Siberia and Scandinavian countries become warmer and drier. Currently these areas are home to the world's largest biome, known as the Targa. It in turn represents nearly a third of the world's forest cover. Following the pattern in Australia, this could lose nearly all of its woodland as the area becomes drier and warmer. The possibility of the loss of the coniferous forests in this area and its knock-on effect on climate change could be more dramatic than anything else we've yet observed. But what do you think?